hello hello so in my last video we finished my kind of first impressions first playthrough of another farm roguelike and today like the title says we're gonna jump into hard mode give this a try the game's been too easy so far oh it looks like they've actually changed it so easy is surviving for five weeks and hard is surviving for seven weeks i wonder if there's any other differences or if that's it but uh yeah we'll jump into this and when i said that the okay so the amount is different you need 2500 the first week and like i said the developer has been like super great about updating this game i wasn't kidding so today we got an update where instead of on upgrade day you can get like the the animals and the orange stuff now you uh, instead you just buy it in the shop so that's a new thing also some quality of life stuff like you can control left click to sell a whole stack of items in your inventory <clears throat> and there's a whole giant overhaul of the crafting system or not the crafting system the upgrade system that's supposed to happen probably tomorrow so got that to look forward to and uh yeah there's so i'm also i'm recording this on september 8th the thursday and you're not going to see it until probably september 13th which is a tuesday so just a heads up that like if it looks like there's something missing in my version of the game there could be like all kinds of crazy stuff that's added by the time we get to next week so that's always a possibility too uh, so I've been thinking about like what I want to actually do in hard mode. I think I want to do like a no dig build. Uh, I don't know. I was thinking about like getting juice and making tons of juice in the keg and then hope that I get the, uh, there's like a fruit in the shop upgrade that you can get. So if I did that and then my main concern with that was running out of coal, but if I can get... 25,000 coal, I can do that, but I feel like one of the best things to start with is always to start upgrading your tools. I think that's consistently a good choice, so I'm going to start off by doing that. I get some stone, make some furnaces, and get some copper ore cooking for today. I think I'm just going to toss my furnaces up here like so it's weird that I can't like touch the trees there for some reason okay we can make three of them do I make three yeah sure I don't know if I'm going to be able to finish these all with stone tools looks like I will be able to okay then we can toss three copper in there uh if I have the energy for it it would actually be really nice to make another furnace because then i can upgrade two tools tomorrow i don't know if i'm gonna have the energy i hope this gives me five stone it did nice fingers crossed i got enough energy for this sweet then i just need to get one more copper which is right here okay i'll toss that in there um, I guess it's really going to come down to what my perk is tomorrow. It's going to kind of determine my play style. I think I'm going to chop these to get a little bit of fruit so that I can start getting a tiny bit of money to sell seeds. And then I'll also get a little bit of wood out of it. And then I'm kind of clearing room to build some more stuff up here at some point too. And I'm now out of energy, so let's get, oh, I like that. This says price range right there, so I don't have to keep flipping back and forth anymore. That's actually really good. So I'm gonna sell the oranges. Since these are 12, I think I'm gonna hold out and see if I can get a few more dollars tomorrow. It can only possibly go down by $2, but it could go up by $8, so that sounds like it makes sense to me. Woods at the bottom of the price range. I want to keep my coal anyways. 
And that's all I can do today. So let's see what our upgrade is. First hard mode upgrade. We got fishes, 1.5 value. Crops take one last day to grow. Gathering freak, trees, bushes, and rocks, and ores get one more resource. Or I could reroll. I kind of want to do this. Yeah, let's do it. I've never done that before. So I'm going to upgrade. Whoop, I'm going to upgrade my axe and my pick, I believe, would make the most sense. Especially if I do turn out to not be farming. Oh, it takes three copper bars, so I can't actually do my pickaxe just yet. Okay. So I'm definitely going to need this. Maybe I'm going to make another furnace, actually. I can make two furnaces if I want. Let's do that. The faster I get my upgrades, the better. And I can always start cooking some uh, iron. Why did I not remember what iron is called? Okay, so let's go in. Oh yeah, berry price is much better today. So I could buy seeds if I want. I don't know if I want to. But I... I do have to dig uh, if I want to make, because I have to make bottles for the juice, right? Where are those even? Bottle used to store various drinks. Yeah, so I gotta get my shovel upgraded and then get tons of sand and then I'm gonna do that by the end of the week. That actually might be tough. I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't have <laughs> sold all of my fruit. Yeah, I'm going to need to make it into juice. I'm not too optimistic about this. This is kind of scary having to make $2,000 with absolutely nothing right now. Okay, I probably cut too much stuff down there, but now let's toss down some kegs. 10 wood, so I can make three of these. And I'm like 90% sure that it's gonna say I need a bottle, yeah. Um, since the berry prices are so good, I think I'm gonna go ahead and sell those today. So I think I'm going to have more fruit than I can possibly sell. And uh, what else do I want to do? I don't know. I guess I'm just going to chop a couple more bushes down. I don't have energy to do another one. Okay. Next. And we can definitely do a couple upgrades. Bloop. Okay, so we want to do pickaxe and shovel, probably. How much? Bloop. I have two copper bars left, so let's make one in case I want to upgrade something else. Like I said, if I'm not going to plant anything, then I don't need a hoe or a Maybe the hammer would be nice. I'm probably not going to fish or do the watering can. So let's get some iron today, I think. Oh, wow, I got six from that. That's crazy. Where's all the iron? There's one. There's a big one. Do I want to... Risk all of my energy chopping a giant one like that down? I don't know. I don't really see any other iron. I don't know if I'm going to be able to upgrade all my tools. Okay, we got eight. 
This must have like a ton of iron in it. We'll see. Six. There might be one hiding behind that thing. There's one. It's hard to see because the gray is so light colored. Anyways, that's lots for today. So we can, how many of these do we need for upgrade? Five, wow, okay. Oh, it depends on the tool. Hammer's only three. That's interesting. I didn't know there was a difference between different tools and the hole only takes one. Huh, okay. Well, I think I want to upgrade my main tools right away. So that's going to be five. And then I'm going to have three copper bars that I can use. And I have a ton of energy today. Can I upgrade my fishing rod for two? No, that would have maybe been worth it. I guess we're going to do this. because I'm going to build stuff for sure. Um, what kind of prices do we have? Oranges are really good today. I think I gotta sell that. I don't know if I'm gonna make $2,500 in three more days. It's gonna be rough. I don't think selling coal is gonna do anything there. Um, man, I need to start digging and making some juice, I think. So let's do that. Oh, shoot. You actually have to hoe first. So I guess I do have to upgrade that hoe. And I can't do it because I upgraded the hammer already today. Dang it. Well, let's just see if I can get a couple sand. Oh, I can't even put it in a furnace today <laughs> because my furnace is totally used. So, oh man, I feel like these furnaces are really going to be a bottleneck. So I think I'm going to actually have to make a couple more of those. Oh, I think you can also hold this down now. No, I thought I heard that you could hold that down and it would automatically click, but it doesn't seem like that's the case. Let's build these I don't know if two is even going to be enough what are we going to put in there uh, hey first of all what does juice sell for I can decide what juice I want apple juice sells for up to 120 so is orange juice. Yeah, they're all the same. So it doesn't matter what fruit I pick. But I do want to start making juice. I need to sell like... I don't even know what the math on that works out to be. But a lot of juices. More than 10 juices in the next three days. Um, can I get enough stone to make one more furnace. Can I get real greedy? Set the stone, okay. Um, build. I should really cut that tree down. But, well. Oh, I just need two more. If I hit this rock, I think with my perk, it's gonna give me two stone. Oh, give me four stone, holy, okay. Let's see if we can get one more built. Nice. Okay, so we're going to get... Oh, but I don't have enough coal. <laughs> oh, now it said I do. I don't know why it... Okay. Let's hope that this will break. Yes. Okay. Toss that in there. Nice. Okay, so we got four bottles that we can make tomorrow. Oh, that was all of my energy for day three. I think I'm just going to go the full week for this episode at least. Okay. Tool upgrades. Well, first of all, let's make the bottles. 
12. I'm confused. Do you get more than one? I must have got more than one glass for sand. That was a lot. Okay. Um, <clears throat> so I want the hoe upgrade. I'm not going to, I definitely don't need to water any crops and uh, fishing. I kind of like to have just as like an emergency kind of thing, but I feel like I should focus on a couple things instead of trying to upgrade everything right now. So, um, I have to pull bottles. That's a fair amount. Do I want to go axe or pickaxe first? I think I go axe first. Let's make the pickaxe. I'm going to need five. Shovel only takes two, and this only takes two. Hmm. I think I throw at least five iron into the furnace and a medical again. Great. Just get our coal cover. So we got one, two, three, four, five. I can already make nine juices. I wonder if I'm going to get more than one bottle back too, because then it's going to be a lot of money. But if it's one for one, then not so much. Uh, if I have a lot of wood, I'm actually going to make more of those today. I do not, but I can get some wood. Um, because I'm bottlenecked, not by bottles, but by kegs. Uh, I'll just get these out of the way because I don't need them. I think I put more iron in this today. And then I'm going to try and spend my energy cutting down some trees to get wood. And then I'm going to make a couple more kegs and basically as much wood as I can get, I can put into kegs. Just need enough energy kept to actually build it. That's probably like two kegs worth. Do these have little smiley faces on it? They kind of look like it. Okay, do I go pure apple? I feel like it's smart to diversify, probably, right? And put some uh, oranges in too, just in case the orange juice price is better than the apple juice price tomorrow. Or some berry juice. Is there a berry tree or do berries only grow on bushes? I think berries only grow on bushes. Let's chop down a orange tree. Okay, build another one of these. Just keep stacking them up. And that's gonna be orange. Um, I can maybe get like two more kegs out of this. Then do I sell the fruit? I think I'm only gonna sell the fruit that's like $20 today. Dang, I got five oranges from that. That's like 100 bucks. Or is it 80 bucks? Yeah, 80. Okay. One more tree. Do I have like 10 or 20 wood? No, I need one more. Okay, just trying to squeeze every dollar that I can out of this energy. I think I put an apple in here, and then, like, this is good money for today. I think we sell oranges. Okay. We're gonna get in there. $642 out of 2500 uh, And these juices, ideally, are gonna be worth, like, 100 bucks each. We got, like, seven of them there already, so that might be 
optimistically $700. We'll see if that works out or not. A little bit of energy left. What do I do with it? Do I need more coal? Not really. Uh, <clears throat> probably going to need iron at some point, but I say just keep chopping stumps and getting more wood. I'm not going to be able to build another one. Let's just take a... I don't even have enough energy to take a swing at that. Do I have enough energy to fish? Used to catch fishing. 30% catch chance. Oh, it actually tells you that now. I wonder what the gold is versus that. Okay, so we got five bottles. I'm going to have to cook some more bottles tomorrow. I don't have enough to even put in there, but that's fine. Next day. I don't know. It's going to be close. Two more days to make a lot of money. Let's hope we have some good juice prices. What do you got? 45. That's the worst possible juice price for that. That's pretty bad too. So we gotta hold on to those. We're gonna have to have good juice prices tomorrow or we're in trouble. Okay, so we can upgrade shovel. Five, six, seven. Oh, I thought that took one. Okay. Yeah, I think I do. Ho and pick, though. So I'm going to want to make at least two iron bars today. And then try and get a bunch more glass. So these can go in here. I'm surprised these holds didn't fill in already. It's weird. One sand, a monkey. Lots of grass. I guess I can sell the grass because I'm not going to need any. Uh... Yeah, it's a good grass day. We'll sell that. I'm not going to make any scarecrows. Sand can go in here. Um, that's getting upgraded. Those are not. I'm not going to bother upgrading those this week. It's too late. We're all in on this juice strategy. <laughs> Hopefully it works out. Mm. So we're going to have more than enough bottles tomorrow, I think. I'm going to get a little bit more sand. And then I'm going to see if I can make some more kegs. Come on, sand. I need better than that. Okay. We only have four of these left anyway. Sell the grass. That grass is decent money, actually. Maybe I'm just going to dig the grass up today. No coal. Oh, man. Again. Give me the coal. Thank you. Alrighty. Now we try and get some wood. And there's no way that I can get bottles today. But I can get some more fruit. Uh, let's clear this out and I can build some stuff up here, I guess. At some point. Uh, if I want wood, I should actually be hitting these stumps. I think they probably could be more wood. Do you think I can break this and then have enough? Oh, I haven't. Okay, let's make four of these first before I do anything else. Ooh, 
I actually can't sell the juice that I make tomorrow. So it's whatever I have here. Is it going to be possible? I got 20 apples to sell. Oh, and the price is good. And those are good too. I think we sell the fruit today. And hold the juice. And uh, as long as we can get $400 from our juice tomorrow, and we're going to have 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 juices. So I don't think it's possible, even at the low price, that we won't hit the rent now. So that's good. Um, I'm going to need fruit tomorrow to put in the thing. I guess I'll diversify a bit and I'll get some berries to put in the thing. Just because I don't know which one is going to have a good price. So we can kind of hedge our bets. Although, yeah, I'm making this tomorrow, so I'm not going to be able to use that money till next week. Never mind. I can kind of harvest whatever I want then. I should have just chopped apples then. That's fine. Okay. That's all my energy. Uh, I think I just sell these. If I'm not going to be able to produce the juice to sell it tomorrow before the red day. So let's do that. And then, yeah, we're like within $90 of our goal. So nice. Wait, not $90, within less than $500. We got the juice though. Come on, juice prices, what do we got? Meh, meh. Gotta sell though, unless, maybe it's worth to sell just highly priced juice again today. Um, wanna build one of these for sure. Oh shoot, what? Those can stack that close together? What? Why did I put them so far apart? Okay, that's a thing that you can do. And uh, I have no bottles today though, so that's something. And the last tool that I want is the iron hammer. If I was gonna make glass, or if I was gonna make a gold tool, I guess it's got to be the axe again. Because I'm going to be chopping all of this fruit down. So, uh, I don't know. I think I just make a ton of glass today. Oh, wait, I don't do that. I make bottles like this. So I actually can put the juice in here today. I need to get some berries. Let's go with bushes. Very indecisive about this sell or not sell fruit thing. I, mean, I have to put some in those kegs for next week. It's probably going to be at least five thousand dollars. So yeah, let's put nine of those. Let's do some oranges and then some of these. Okay. Oranges are good today. I'll hold on to that. Apples aren't great. Ah, dude, do I sell my juice? I don't know. <laughs> I could just sell some wood. Um, hmm. Like 400 more dollars, huh?
No coal. I wish these would go away faster. Also, I think the ground is not going to unho itself. This is going to look pretty ugly for a long. Ah, that's not good. Got four glass. Uh, we get more glass. Man. I might have to upgrade my, my fishing rod for next week. I don't know. Hmm. Do I want more sand? Uh, I don't really need to upgrade these unless I want gold. Do I want to spend my energy on gold today? Not really. There's only that one big gold. Oh no, I got lots of little gold rocks. Maybe I'll... How much do I need to do the axe? Blip. Six. I don't even have six furnaces free, so uh, I guess we're doing sand. Oh, I wish I had one more. Come on. Come on. Give me the sand. Give me the sand. Thank you. Okay, that's done. We sell the grass. Uh, okay, rent is covered. I don't even have to sell my crappy juices today. Or my fruit that's not worth anything. I got 10 bottles for tomorrow and a bunch of sand already cooking. Uh, I think I try and make another furnace. Because every day I need 1, 2, 3, 4, 8, 12, 13, 14 uh, jars. And I didn't really, I wasn't paying attention to how many glass I get per sand. But, oh well. I don't know. Am I going to end up making a bunch more kegs? Uh, what to do? What to do? I mean, you can't go wrong harvesting fruit. So I, I guess I'm just going to stock up on some more fruit. I got wood along with it, so that's always nice. of energy cool 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 and uh i think i want to hold on to even 20 dollar oranges although that's 200 bucks i don't know but one orange juice is going to be worth 120 so i get i think we just go we're broke how much is it going to cost for next week $12,000. Okay. We can do it. Maybe. Okay, so we make bottle, bottle, bottle. 40 bottles. Probably don't have to make any more glass for today. Uh, bad price, bad price. Well, over 100 bucks for those. these guys in here still want to kind of diversify my juices so that 
what everyone is giving me good money. Let me get, do that. Uh, what was I going to use the furnace for? Just the gold, I guess. Is this going to be the gold harvesting day? I need six, right? Yeah, so. Coal. Bloop. What else? Is there anything? Like, can I like cook apples? No, nope. no baked apples. Hmm. Can I cook juice? I don't think I want to try. So. I think the right move is to keep doubling down on juice and making more kegs. I did not realize that I could stack them that close together. That's kind of crazy. I should get more sand today then. Especially if I'm gonna make another three of them. <laughs> I can actually stack it into the water. Just, it bothers me to have it half falling into the sea like that, so I'm going to pass on that. If I have energy left after this, I might make another furnace. I don't want to dig up here because I want to be able to build stuff. I have a feeling that you can't build stuff on this ugly dug up land. I just need one more sand. One more sand. Thank you. Okay, so that'll make me some... I should pay attention tomorrow and see how much glass I actually harvest. Uh, da, da, da. I think I sell grass if it's above $20. Eventually, I'm going to need this when I start running out of coal. So that'll be interesting. But um, do I want more kegs? Do I want more furnaces? How is this going to work? feel like kegs, but I think I'm going to need some more coal eventually anyways. I might as well break some of these. Gives me some more space to dig up sand on. Yeah, I guess I can load up on a little bit of sand too. Let's dig a few more squares. So I don't know if there's like good luck and bad luck, but it feels like a bad luck for sand day. Whoops. That was a nice dig. Got four. Do I have any pre... Yeah, I can just do this now in some of these spots. Uh, it wastes energy, I think, if you don't do three in a row, though. It's the only thing. But yeah, I guess I'm not going to have to Oh, these at least I'm just gonna have to come back and shovel them when they fill in so I got 10 sand for tomorrow already that's good well let me just like cut down a couple bushes with my energy that I have left sell these again can I sell this no <laughs> I would sell the $20 berries. I think I gotta keep them all at this point for the juice. Okay, next day. 
right? Yeah. Week two. We survived one week. So what do we get out of this? We get three glass for every sand that we put in. Look at all those juices. I might run out of glass today for the bottles. I need more fruit. Uh, this is gonna go in here. Nice, perfect. Upgrade the axe, I think, right? Pickaxe probably doesn't make that much sense. Man, that only has 50% catch rate. Well, I guess you get nine squares, so. Mm. Let's go axe. Okay, we need fruit. I don't know if it uses the same amount of energy to cut down the bush. Maybe it's a waste to get the bushes with the golden axe. I don't know. We do. Do I get plus one items drop for that golden axe? I think that was a thing too, right? Plus two resources. Yeah, I think that would apply to uh, fruit, hopefully. It looks like it. I got like 14 apples, 16 oranges. It's like not taking any energy. <laughs> okay, so now I'm like loaded with fruit. Nice. Um, okay, now what? And what does my diversity here look like? 117, that's decent. 70, not so much. Okay, so we're gonna sell berry juice today for $117. Boop, there's 2,000. Uh, so I'm gonna make a bunch more berry juice to replace those in case the price is good again tomorrow. And I have two more bottles. And I have 52 wood, so I think we do two more kegs and then hopefully I have the energy left over to dig up some sand still. What do you mean no bottle? There we go, okay. Yeah, let's get some sand for tomorrow. None of these filled in completely, huh? <laughs> My entire island is just full of holes now. hard to get enough sand to keep up on my bottle supply every day. I should really be farming because there's like that synergy there that I'm digging holes for a reason as opposed to just letting them fill back in. Like I could have crops growing in all these holes right now instead of just nothing. I mean I guess I could come back and redo them. Then I would have to water everything though by hand. And I have a stone watering can, so I don't know. I think maybe I just go until I run out. So I've got 12 sand now. We're good for tomorrow for sand. Do I want to build more furnaces? Do I want to build more kegs? Who knows? Let's definitely take this rock out though, just because. Um. I can make a sprinkler, I can make a scarecrow, and buy some seeds. I guess 
Let's wait and see what tomorrow's upgrade day is. If I get like a, a crop focused upgrade, then I'm probably going to want to shift to scarecrows and sprinklers. But for now, let's just get some more fruit and wood. Although I have quite a lot of fruit now. <laughs> Uh, berries don't exist anymore. I have harvested them to extinction. I'm not really thinking about transitioning to another way to make money though at this point. So once I cut all these trees down, I'm kind of screwed. So then I would have to pay for the, uh, oh, there's not even a fruit up a mock in here. I have to get the fruit in the store perk. On the upgrade day. <sighs> okay. What else can I do? I got wood. I can make some bee houses. They're not great. It's uh, honey is only worth like what, like forty-five. Where is it? Yeah, forty-five on the high end. I wish there was something I could actually make from honey, but alas, I don't think that's the case. I need like an alcohol distillery where you make like whiskey from wheat and mead from honey and stuff. Wine, if there was like, I guess the berries could be like grapes. Uh, what else? I guess. We're always going to need more sand, right? So let's just load up on some sand. <laughs> I got one sand out of that many holes. That sucks. I don't have enough to dig there. Uh, grass price is bad today, so I'm going to hold on to those. Mm. What can I do? Is there anything that only costs two gold bars? Watering can, which I don't need. Nah. Okay, so I'm done for today. Perks, let's see what we get. Okay, we can have the wheat, which I did last run. Uh, performance, cost of using tools is reduced by one, not less than one. It's like an energy buff. And then we got cauliflower, kale, and parsnip value times two. But they already kind of have bad value. It's still called triple upgrade because it was originally originally times three, but that's kind of bad. Uh, I think I'm gonna re-roll this and see what happens. Uh, Max energy. Oh, that got nerfed too. Juice expert. That's what we want right there. No doubt. No doubt in my mind that is the right choice. Let's uh, get her. Sand in there for tomorrow's bottles. Craft these. Um, okay, so it doesn't change the price range and take that into account. Uh, so what we could theoretically, the highest price should be 360. Right? So apple juice is as good as it gets today. Definitely sell that. That covers our rent, which is sweet. Made the right choice with that perk. And uh, yeah, we're going to wait and see if we can get these to like, I don't know, anywhere above like 280, 300, I'd probably sell those for. Grass is good enough today. Do I want to start planting stuff though? That's the question. I don't know. It's definitely okay. Let's get rid of these three from my inventory, and then uh, so I had 30 bottles. So, what do we have left after this? So, I have 24 bottles per day that I need. <clears throat> and I'm making 30 a day. So I could make <laughs> even more kegs. I have the wood for it too. Let's 
This doesn't seem very sustainable. I feel like I can't do anything else except keep up on this. And I really need to start planting some crops. But whatever. <laughs> well, I'm glad that I made tons of money from that, though. That was sweet. Um... I think we still have to make Scarecrow. Where do I have holes that have already been dug that maximizes his space? Probably in there once I take this out. Right. I'll do that. And I need a sprinkler and some more stone. I think that is actually on the corner of that, but that's fine. I'll break that eventually. Uh, I thought I had the copper, but not the stone. Also, this is getting, uh, I guess, nerfed, like the price of the sprinkler. The dev is going to make it so there's three different sprinklers, like a, just like the upgrades, there'll be a bronze, iron, and gold, I think. Okay, so we have to make a bar today, even if that means making another furnace, I'm going to do it. So I want a sprinkler tomorrow. Get to the kappa. Thank you. Just need one, so that's fine. And uh, yeah, we have money to spend on seeds today. What are we gonna get? Sunflowers for sure. Uh, is kale really worth it? Wait, does it say on the... No, it doesn't say because those are seeds. 40. No, I think I only want to do pumpkins and sunflowers. Whoop. All right. Buy all. And... Do I want to reroll? Hmm, sure. I'm not even close to being able to afford these. Pumpkins, pumpkins, that, okay, that should be good. We have some kind of income besides juice. I gotta remember to actually water these though, because I never don't have a sprinkler. <laughs> Not used to having to actually look after my crops. They just kind of work themselves out, typically. Oh, I should. Yeah. Uh, how much copper is that going to cost? Just one. Yeah, let's. We got to toss down another furnace just for that. So my watering is easier tomorrow. Boop. And then we'll just do it the difficult way today. What am I doing? There we go. I think there's a... I think I planted something, but I'm not 100% sure. I'm just going to waste some energy watering it every day anyways. Okay, that took less energy than I thought. That's nice. Uh, I'm not going to spend $200 to reroll. And I'm not going to have the resources to do wheat and windmills this run. And I passed on the wheat perk anyway, so that's a thing. What else do we have? We got like a little bit of wood, not too much stone. That's good. I don't have like too much of things, you know. Grass price could be better. We'll hold off. Uh, I'm 
cooking lots of sand today, right? Yeah, so let's gather some more sand. So I really need to have like 20 sand per day, so it's, it's a lot to keep up on. Especially when that doesn't seem that common. I wonder what the percent chance of getting sand is. Ooh, that one filled in completely, but I wasted my energy anyways. Nice. Uh, I think these are all clear. <clears throat> this is crazy. It's like Gopher Island. I should really be clearing some of this out too. <clears throat> so that I can maximize this space. Oh shoot, I think I'm going to want to put a sprinkler there and I don't think it's gonna let me place it on a hole so uh, we'll see how that works tomorrow I think I gotta chop these down if I want to use those squares up there okay that's good um, try and get a little bit more sand I guess uh, hopefully I don't need to build over here anytime soon. This is the dumbest strategy, but it's actually working. I love that I got like the three times perk on the juice. That's going to be super helpful. Don't know if I would have made it to 12,000 otherwise. Now I have zero energy right now. Okay. Well, it's coming up on an hour, so I guess that's going to be it for this episode. We'll stop on uh, week two, day three, start off again that time. I'm curious to see what the price is going to do. One from 2500 to 12000 Is it going to go to like 40000 next week? I hope not. Yeah, we got like four more days to make as much money as we possibly can and then I guess I'm gonna have to shift over to farming what else can I do I mean I got the golden axe so I could just chop down a ton of wood and make a bee house but 15 wood is pretty expensive and uh, you get what like 45 is the best price for the honey so if you get 10 honeys a day, that's only $450 times a week. I don't know, 10 days would be $4,500. It's nice like passive income in the sense that you make it and then it's done, but uh, I don't know. It's like not scalable enough. It's like fishing. You always got to switch to the crops and then eventually to animals, I feel like. And this price is crazy. That's going to be tough to get that before like week four uh, and pay rent at the same time. But yeah, that's uh, going to be it for today. Thanks for watching and we will continue our hard mode journey tomorrow. So stay tuned.